up guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm gonna show you how i got this very cute fluffy lightweight butterfly locks yes butterfly locks in crochet form um i don't know why i never knew that they had this at the beauty supply because i had to usually do it by myself with like the thumb tricks and stuff but now that they got it i would never do all that work ever again and i feel like people who are paying to get this hairstyle done are just wasting their money because man this was so easy crocheting is so easy don't don't pay nobody to do this look so if you don't know how to do it watch this video and you'll most definitely leave here with the knowledge of how to do it okay but um if you want to know how many packs the brand how many hair is in the pack and how many locks i have all in the description box because honestly i'm just gonna be fast playing and me doing it and yeah because it honestly it's so easy that i didn't have to really say too much in the video for you to get it because it's like it's kind of repetitive just put the needle in boom 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 done but yeah if you're interested in how i got this look continue watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you like this look and yeah also for my new people out there hey i provide all types of content on this channel so if you like diys vlogs hair makeup nails anything you could think of i will do if i haven't done it now i will be doing it in the future so just just subscribe because you're gonna you're gonna be happy if you subscribe here you know and comment down below if you're new because i want to give you a warm welcome i want to you know shout out you and all that good stuff and also i want to address something really quickly so before we get into the hair I noticed that all my nail videos have a very, very good like and comment ratio. But when it comes to any other type of video, I don't have that same love on that side. And it's kind of like downing because I'm not a strictly nail channel. I am a everything channel. I do hair, like I said, nails, vlogs, fashion. I do it all. So when one type of like niche of my channel gets more recognition than the other, it's kind of downing because i enjoy doing multiple things and not just one so if you are just here for nails you know support your girl in all the areas <laughs> before you just jump to my nail videos but let's just get into the video let me show you how i got this look real quick and simple peace
looking like so far they're really really cute and i feel like i can knock these out in the next 15 minutes so i'm going to show you guys one more time how to do it close up and step by step because i'm going to turn off the camera and show you guys the end result so you're going to go through your hair take a lock now with these you have to stretch out the hole so this part right here you're going to get it when it's like tight you're going to pull it down to make it wider because all these grooves and stuff is going to make it hard to like push through if the hole is too small so you're going to have it open attach the little loop to the crochet needle and pull it through your hair ow don't let it go like i just did then while it's through your hair you're going to put your needle back inside of this loop take the end of the hair ow it's got in my eye and you're going to put it on the tail close the latch hook and send it through the hoop that you made in the beginning and pull it all the way through back up to your hair and you see all these grooves and stuff you would not be able to do that if you didn't stretch out the hole so please make sure you do that then you're going to tighten it um but i'm loosening mine up because i want this to be a protective style i don't want no tension on my scalp too much so you can make it as tight or loose as you want and then once you have this excess piece of hair you're just going to wrap it wrap it twice that's what i do I'm gonna take this needle, I'm gonna send it through this lock, take my hair and just weave it through the braid, the lock, the braid, whichever one you wanna call it. Um, you gonna weave it through until you don't see your hair anymore. And it's okay if you get a little bit of stringy pieces, just wrap those back around. And then boom, you know, I don't really mind my hair being seen but if you guys want me to show you the invisible method i can do that because that is understandable why you need to learn how to do that but for me it don't really matter because this hair is already like dark brown then light brown at the end so that's kind of what my hair is doing and it's not really that big of a deal to me because it already has like a messy look you know what i mean yes that's how you do that i'm gonna come back on to show you how i'm gonna put in these beads or if i'm gonna put the beads in which i am but if you're curious about that stay to the end to see the finishing look and the beads
Okay, y'all, so I'm done with this hairstyle. It's super cute, and I know that look exactly the same from the beginning. So don't even don't even talk about it. But I wanted to say sorry that it wasn't so like vocal in this video. It was more like too repetitive for me to keep saying, hey, open the latch hook, send it through. You know, I thought you would have gotten it. And if you didn't get it, I have a step-by-step -step video on the Fox Locks. And I know I talked way more on how to do it better than what I'm doing now. So it's kind of like reteaching it and it's just like it's not that hard to get but like i said if you want to know i'll link it down below for you to know how to do the crocheting thing but it's super easy just open close pull through boom but what i do want to do a step by step and show y'all is if y'all don't get the bead adder tool and y'all bead kit you know because i got these beads and they didn't give me the little tool i was like i thought every batch was supposed to come with a tool i got these too i can't really do it because i don't want to yeah i don't want that to happen why am i getting notifications right now tough but yeah i'm gonna show you how to do that because i feel like that's something to do a tutorial over because it's a little more difficult i guess but i already started some so what i would do is take a light chug it don't matter the size unless you're doing something super super small which you can't for this look anyway so if you have a regular latch hook like this one and this one either or will work but i would just simply take the hook take the bead do it like that where did the hair just there we go i'm going to then open the hook close it send it through bam that's it that's it that's all then now you're going to take a rubber band you're going to actually slide this down a little bit more so it shouldn't be that much I think that much would do and i'm going to just wrap this rubber band around the actual end like just a couple of times you know and then from the end i'm gonna go i'm gonna go like right here so i'm gonna wrap it around there can you see that yeah you see how i got it now underneath and then i'm just gonna do it one more time and boom we're just gonna leave it like that you know what i'm saying yeah because i don't know when did they stop giving the the bead attacher was i supposed to buy that separately i don't remember redoing that when i was younger but anyways yeah that's basically everything with this video i'm gonna do a how to style this look video probably friday because i'm trying to post like mondays and fridays and i'm kind of a tight schedule right now because it's monday right now and i'm trying to upload it and edit it in the same day so Wish me luck. If not, it will most definitely be out Tuesday. And yeah, look in the description box for the, the packs and how many were in the pack, how many is in my head. Any questions you have, it should be answered in the description box. But if I didn't answer it, comment down below. I got you. I'm on it. You know what I mean? Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like if you actually enjoyed the video. And I'll see you in the next one.